Welcome to Mortal Shell with me and my wife, Aalto. Hi. This is a Dark Souls-alike slash Dark Soulsian game, whatever you call the genre, made by Cold Symmetry, which is a pretty small company. So it's like it's a game that looks very good and like like it could be a triple A game, but it's definitely not made by a company that had those sort of resources like from software. It's not actually quite out yet at the time of recording, but I've read some previews and it's supposed to be pretty good but has some issues with uh, repetition. Played for about 10 minutes just to check settings and stuff like that, so pretty much haven't played. Overwrite that, start a new game. Look at her butt. <laughs> there, there is no butt. You have been <laughs> denied butt. I mean, the muscles are there. They're just kind of turned to flexible stone. So this is like a tutorial area. This is one of the big abilities to harden. <laughs> <laughs> if we can become hard at a moment's notice. That's uh, what she said? Yeah. No, it's defi it definitely is. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's supposed to be like a really big, important gameplay thing because you can harden at a moment's notice even if you're in the middle of an attack animation. Ah. Prevents harm from attacks, but is broken quickly upon taking physical damage. Left trigger. So we can lock on. Ooh. sword with a hollow at its center so it seems to be pretty um like dark soulsian uh kind of attacks where there's like a light attack and then you can like charge up a harder attack you may harden in most situations even while attacking experiment with hardening at different times i love this <laughs> <laughs> Try it in line at the grocery store. God. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> this is a children's game. Don't you dare make sort of erection jokes. Okay. <laughs> oh, it says plus. It's not like next to each other, but actually like as a combo. Maybe not. <laughs> Am I doing it? Like attack, harden, attack, harden. Yeah, you are. Defo. Yeah, 
Maybe there's some sort of a timing thing that I'm not getting. Mm -hmm. Was that it? I guess. Do I do anything differently? I guess you just got the timing down. Hmm. By accident or by purpose. Oh, definitely by accident. Okay, well, I wanted to give you credit. <laughs> <laughs> Mortal token. Um. Token which begets a connection to the mortal realm. Next damage taken while hardened is converted to health. Oh, right, there's the running attack. Should I explain to people why I'm here co commentating? Uh, yeah, sure. So, I've, like, loved Marsh doing Dark Souls. It's always been really satisfying to watch because she's, like, good at games or whatever, and the games are good. I just really love watching her play. So that's why when Sekiro came out, I wanted to, like, be there watching her play. I could not wait to watch the Let's Play, so I just had to be there, you know? And then she played through Dark Souls 3 for Patreon exclusives, and I was there as well. And so it felt very appropriate that, as this is a very Dark Souls CN game, that I should also be here experiencing it at the moment in the moment yeah and it's really nice to have someone else along with me while i'm doing this because it can get really grindy sometimes and frustrating so sometimes it's nice to have somebody else there to support me i don't feel so alone trying yes. to finish a boss <laughs> for the 20th time i have three uses one is emotional support Command two is um, tell me to look at something in the screen that you can't focus on while you're doing something else, like looking at how many numbers a health goes down or something. Oh, yeah. And a third one is screaming, drink Estus! Drink Estus now! <laughs> yeah, I have no idea if there's a healing system in this game. No idea. Well, then I'll be like, harden! Get hard! <laughs> Get hard, Marsh! Just like last night, Marsh, get hard! So this time I do have health, and I am definitely not going to defeat this enemy. I lost last yeah. time I tried to defeat it. And you have seven as well, but like a shit ton of it. Yeah. But it didn't matter that I lost. I think it was intended for you to lose. Makes me curious what would happen if you didn't. I dislike that their name is Harden. I know, it's like Harden. Yeah. Whoa. School's over. <laughs> wow, it's very quiet. Yeah. That's another reason why I'm here. I'm here to like make jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Fulgrim, a tower hums where a muted dweller ruminates his fate. I think we might be forced to be 
a man, unfortunately. I think in all the promotional material I've seen, they're always a man. I love how, like, instead of not having a dick, they just have, like, instead of not having a dick or not having anything there, they have this, like, fat, 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 fat pussy. Just, like, <laughs> a total, total, total fupa camel toe. Love it. Mm hmm. That is quite a bump. <laughs> Oh, this is so cool. I love this. This is like a title card kind of thing. Crawling through this freaking endless tunnel. It's such a cool sequence. Last thing my food sees before it comes out. <laughs> Such a cool and weird sequence. It's like gravity didn't work for that, right? Yeah. Like gravity didn't apply? Because I'm pretty sure we went straight up and, and all sorts of weird things. It's just a really cool sequence. Mm. That's weird. This is where I stopped playing. I never inhabited the unknown shell. Oh. <laughs> it's called armor. <laughs> Clothes. Is that how you do armor upgrades? You just find a new body and you're like, yoinks? <laughs> Maybe. A man is more than just a sleeve. He's a whole shirt, too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I like that little, like, dust or smoke yeah. or something. Damn, you found some sort of a speed stun strat immediately. Yeah, how did I do that? You hit and then you like dashed. And I'm not even sure. I'm trying to do that still, but... See, that's oh, why... Oh yeah, just like <laughs> tap, tap the dash button right after. Oh, I used up all my stamina. We have a lot less stamina now than we did Aww. before. It's because we have all this shitty armor shaking my head. Yeah. Two welt caps flourishes where blood is spilled. Uh, I guess, so you get more familiarity with how much you use it, and I think you don't understand what it does until you use it, so I think you have to experiment. Oh. Oh, it looks like it's on the timer. Um, where we picked it up from, where it's gonna like respawn. Huh. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Regenerates 30 health over 30 seconds. Okay, it's a healing item. sure what that actually did just show us like what our goal is maybe hmm huh. a person near a bell yeah pick up 
glimpse of futility. Can we use it, I guess? Glimpses into your shell when consumed. I don't know what that means. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's one of the things they didn't have the resources to do with such a small team, is everything is not breakable like it was in Dark Souls. So sad. <laughs> Rolling through a bunch of barrels and books and stuff. Oh, Well, I hope so this fun. is a commercial hit then, so that we can get Mortal Shell 2. Yeah. Or just like a remastered that changes nothing except adding physics to make yes. everything breakable. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, there better not be mimics. <laughs> <laughs> Simple loot, remnant of tar. Definitely need practice. Yeah. <laughs> it's really cool, though. Hummity, 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 hummity. Can I just keep using it? You ready for me to use it like eight more times until we get it perfect? Yes, because I want to know if the description changes at any point. Because that just said like, still says practice makes perfect. So did, yeah, does having it maxed do anything in particular? No, you just know how to play now. Yeah, sounds really good. I love the mood of this game. It has a very thick atmosphere. When I saw the, um, I haven't looked up anything in the game about the game. My wife talked to me about it, and when I saw the the um, opening screen, I thought it was very apocalypse. If apocalypse happened in the Middle Ages, yeah. Oh, it says the sheer audacity. To play the loot incites enemies to violence from a great distance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have another thing. Remnants of tar. Grants a are. minuscule amount of tar when consumed. Huh. That must be the thing in the bottom right. This is 80 now. I guess that's tar. Hmm. Also, it's a rough world to be a bard in. Yeah. I've always felt like the Finnish word for bard was very funny. It's trubadori. I don't think it's Finnish. Very Finnish in origin. Doesn't sound like very Finnish. But no, like, that sounds like just uh, troubadour. Yeah. Oh. It was so funny to me. It was, it was a child. It's trubadori. Trubadori. Dori. Trubadori. <gasps> it's oh. our sense. Instinct. Censored. All right, you ready to die a lot? I am. I've Shadows heard... die twice. <laughs> Shells heard... die thrice. I've heard the game does not go easy on you. Hmm. Oh, there's frogs. <gasps> Friends. First gotcha. test. Please tell me they don't get squished when I walk. Good, Ye they don't. They did that in Metro Exodus and it was horrible. Oh, oh, this is so sad. I'm not going to dare try to attack them because I don't want to kill them. Good. They are friends. They grant plus 50 good good spirits. Happy emotions. Happy emotions. Plus 50 happy emotions. Is that a person or an enemy? I think those are enemies. I can Was target them, so... <laughs> yeah. Was it Pathologic that had um, chomping mice in it? Uh, yeah. Do you think they want to talk? Yeah. What if the entire game, like, no one attacks you, if no, you never attack anyone? They're just like, so do you, like, play Pokemon? Go? Do you have your cell phone with you? <laughs> I'm looking for a shiny Charizard. Oh my god. That, that thing looks harder. 
Let's see how pulling enemies works. Are you gonna come back with me? It's gonna be so hard not to make a bunch of dick jokes. Right? A harden? And that thing looks harder? Like, come on, that's what she said. That is what she said! Roasted rat. 35 health over 10 seconds. It's interesting. It seems like it's gonna be, um, not like an Estus thing. More like scavenge what you can find and use it to heal. That is interesting. I like that. Yeah, me too. It's not a divine gift. It's just, like, your own personal choice to stay alive. Very cool. We like characters that want to live. Yes, this is kind of exploiting the AI and whatnot, but I don't care. <laughs> With games like this, you take any advantage you can get. Yes. Please, I couldn't even- I couldn't even walk out of that tunnel in the beginning of the game, so... <laughs> I'm not here to judge. And if you're here to judge, I'm here to cyberbully you in the comments. <laughs> They just start in or you? No, that was me. Ah. <laughs> that loop's Poor getting loot. fucked. Everyone loves eating that green goop. Yeah, oh my god. <laughs> you think they're just boiling the water, the swamp water, to get the germs out? Yeah. <laughs> Inferior moonshine. Distilled in the worst possible conditions. <laughs> I don't know why they're boiling the water, because I've heard that if you just filter water through, through moss, moss, it's totally drinkable. Said a guy in a reality TV show once, and then he had to quit the reality TV game to go home because he had a stomach bug. <laughs> yep. Doesn't work. Um, The moonshine isn't showing up in the quick items, so what is it? That's how you level up. Oh yeah, it tells you how many times to use it to reveal more detail. So like for these, I think it's got to be maxed nine more times. This is just mm. four. Sorry, uh, what'd you say? It, it's got to be what? It's how you level up. <laughs> Moonshine. Small amount of res... Oh, wow, that scrolls slow. Resolve, but at the cost of... Their health. Health. Thirty health over thirty seconds. Wow, that is not much. Mm. I mean, it's gonna restore all my health, but it's like very, very slow. That's what therapy does as well. Restore your health very, very slowly. <laughs> yes. Oh shit. Oh, there's bear oh. traps. Oh no! That means that there has to be bears. And I want to see bears and they better not be enemies. Yes. Non-acro bears. Give them. I don't think the Dark Souls series ever had bears. They had a lot, a lot of wolves. Yeah. A lot of wolves, a lot of dogs, especially in Bloodborne, but no bears. Oh, this is a little uh, a trap for trapping oh. animals. Yeah. What kind of animals do you think they catch in a swamp? Frogs? I don't know. I mean, it'd have to be something that can smell and therefore be... Um, incensed by bait to go in there. Therefore, it would have to be something other than a frog. It would hmm. have to be like a mammal, I think. Is that a huge frog I see? 
Also, I'm wondering if I can like disarm these. I don't <gasps> think so. Because I'm basically touching it. Oh, can you like trick your enemy into going in there? Oh, maybe. Oh, I wonder if I can hit it. Eh, not worth it. But yeah, come on. Step in it. See if these trappers remember where they put their own traps. They do <laughs> not. You could target that big frog. Do not, please. Be very careful. I won't. Oh, it's got red eyes. It looks oh. a little intimidating, but I want to be, be friends with it. Oh, it's just, oh, oh. It's just a fat oh, fuck. No, no, no. no. It poisoned illegal. me. It's not illegal to be fat. It's not, but it's illegal to explode on me. Oh. It, it exploded? Yeah, it just touched me and then went into a puff of poison. Oh, God. Well, then maybe it is kinder to kill them before they explode. I think... I imagine I've never, like, died in an explosion, but I imagine <laughs> it has to be painful. Probably. Ugh. Ah. Sorry. Oh god. Oh. The frogs are singing a beautiful song. Love it. They re-poisoned me. Oh, I... Oh, I think I'm just out of healing. Uh-oh. <laughs> yep. So I wonder where you're gonna respawn. Not, not to, like, you know, paint devils on the wall, but... Oh, I'm about to die, aren't I? Yeah, because of the poison. Oh, right! There's a thing where you can, like, go back and find your body. Oh! Huh! <laughs> Does that... Oh, the trap I think looks it like, reset. Yeah, I think it's, like, ready to go again, isn't it? Yeah. I forgot how the recovering your body thing works. You can either get it back or... Oh, what's the other option? Oh, Jesus. Oh, they have, like, a Plague Doctor mask. They do. Very topical. <laughs> Hashtag wear your mask. Oh, no. Hmm. This is my hole. It was made for me. <laughs> Oh, there's something nasty over there. Big blob. Slurry of tar. I love how bizarre the items are. It's very strange. I love it. Once again, that's not showing up in the list. Is it, um... Like, only the first row, maybe, shows up or something? Oh, yeah. Know. They have a little mark on them. Remove... Oh, yeah. Remove quick slot. And then... Assign quick... wait. Huh? Oh, like, select this and then assign it to a quick slot. Ah. That one. Okay, I see. Anyway, uh... I guess let's just use it. It's a currency. Copious tar when consumed. Oh yeah, we've got 860 tar now. Ah, like it's it's like souls in Dark Souls. Yeah. The cats are very hungry for food, and so Peppa's right now literally climbing on Marsh and just like trying to climb on the recording mic. What is that? This better not be a coven. Oh no. <laughs> Is there <laughs> online play? Don't tell me there's online play. No way. Oh, thank God. I don't know, but I oh. really doubt it. <laughs> well, then let's put in our prayers that there are no online play elements. Choosing to renounce all shells forsakes your connection to mortality. You will play the rest of the game without a shell. Um, Your connection to the shells will be severed. You'll lose all progress made with your shells. I... 
I don't know what that is, but I don't think we should do it. Yeah, this sounds like some sort of a uh, hard, hard mode. mode. Yeah. No. I love the crawling through holes thing. It's very creepy. It's very symbolic. Yeah. <laughs> Makes me feel like a worm. <laughs> Oh, to be just a worm in the 15th century. That is truly to live. weapon of any sort, so... I guess I'll just try to bring them back here. Play the loot. Oh. Right. Oh, I think they spotted me. Yeah, someone has. Oh, fucker. Well, they seem to be just telling me off. Oh, um, Peppa messed with your phone. Oh, it's fine. Oh, it worked. Made the other one angry. <laughs> But yeah, they're not coming towards me. They're just flipping me off. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the range weapon privilege. You don't have to go and kill them. You can just flip them off and throw stones. Oh, we're out of stamina. Oh, damn. That old thing, huh? Makes a girl miss Sekiro. Yeah. That was, now that was a man with plentiful stamina. Hey -o. Sex joke. <laughs> Just like in Dark Souls, you can't pause. Oh, wh why? In, in Dark Souls, it makes sense because it's like meant to be online and interactive. But like here, why? Just to make you feel unsafe at all times? There is no safety. Gotta watch my stamina. Oh, fucking hell. You are my little gamer wife. Can I get a, uh, healing item? Can I give, uh, a shout out to a fan who drew you that fan art? Like yeah. you with gamer- <laughs> Shout out to me now for the gamer girl fan art of Marsh. Yeah, thank you so much if you happen to watch this video. I don't know if Dark Souls likes games or your sort of thing. It's not horror-y or survival -y, but it does have- Dread. <laughs> I don't think I can break this. Boiled frog! <gasps> yes! Ooh la la! French cuisine, let's go! Oh, it doesn't heal, it's just re stamina regeneration. Aww! Just like. Just like. <laughs> they give their little jumpies to me. Aww! Oh, they sacrificed themselves to give you, give you, uh, Sonics. <laughs> oh. Superior moonshine, an effigy of some sort. In Breath of the Wild, I was boiling frogs with no sort of, like, qualms about it, making speed potions. But here I'm like, oh, frogs. <laughs> For speed? Seems so wrong. It cannot be used. This shell is unknown. Okay. Ah, uh, you don't know if it has a peanut allergy? Same. Yeah. No, wait, I do know that I don't have a peanut allergy. <laughs> Large amount of resolve. Same. What is resolve? 
don't know what resolve is. And I also don't know how to, like, rest or heal. Can I, like, hang out at a fire? Apparently not. No. I I'm mean, still wondering where you're going to respawn if you die. Yeah. Do One you more hit and I'm dead. Yeah. Such a sad noise. Post mortem flatulence. Mm. It happens. I really. I'm enjoying this feeling of not knowing how anything works. It's kind of fun. It's interesting. I have no <laughs> idea how anything works. The joys of being a noob. Oh, they're not an enemy. Oh? No, they're not. Baghead. Um, yeah. <laughs> Appropriate name. Hey. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to set you up like that. It was my mate's idea. Honest. No hard feelings, right? Oh, you're not him. Not exactly. Uh, if you find any of my mates, maybe you could try them on too. Try them on as shells. Interesting. Chest is locked. Oh, I'm starving. Really could use a bite to eat. It ain't easy sitting here all day, you know. What are you doing sitting here all day? What's your job? Even the NPCs sound like darsals, don't they? They so British! Is that Dark Souls now? You go to England no. and you're like, oh my god, all of these people in their Dark Souls cosplays. No, I don't mean the accent, <laughs> I just mean being mysterious and weird. Oh yeah, but it like the... <laughs> yeah, no laughing. <laughs> Who are you, little creature? Oh, not quite like my mate, are you? <laughs> I've heard most of them have perished by now. Maybe you shall too one day. <laughs> ah, Should we go never here? Never mind. Oh god. <laughs> oh, ah, fuck. I'm dead. Uh, I guess I'll be able to re-enter my body. Maybe. There's gotta be some limit to that though. Anyway, blurg. Yep. Mm. I think you're limited to do it once. Ah. Well, let's see where we get. Put. Do we lose our shell? No. Huh. Um, we lose all our resources, not our uh, our items. Not our items, but we lose our tar, was it? Yeah, tar. We can probably go back and get the stuff we dropped. Mayhaps. Oh, you can pick it out of a shroom. Yes. Man, those squelchy noises when you go into the menu is weird. Yeah. Are the enemies? The enemies all respawn, yep. huh? Nice. I don't know if there's invincibility frames. I assume so. Combat feels very weighty. Yeah. Like you really are swinging some huge ass sword around. This isn't where I died. 
Nope. I guess they'll check it out. It's an item. And another hole. Tar spore. Mistaken for a tar deposit. Noxious mushroom. Often mistaken for a tar deposit. Noxious. Uh, hmm. It's a consumable. <laughs> what is noxious? I don't know what obnoxious is, but what is noxious? Basically means poisonous. Ah. But then obnoxious is not poisonous, but... That's just annoying. Yeah, like, what's the what's the connection between obnoxious and noxious? I don't think there is one. You can't just have... English language, go fuck yourself. Where did we die? Do you know exactly? Um, no. Sorry. I know it was near water, and that's about it. Nice. Okay, now we're receiving some professional gamer wifery. Harden well, but I, I'm, I'm too scared to try to dodge to see if there's invincibility frames. Way too scared to try that. Well, you know what? That's valid. Maybe we should share, um, share, save that till we're like in a spot where we're like, okay, we know our stuff is safe. We don't have any tar we're looking out for. Yeah. Life's a good. Living is easy. Somebody's playing over here. Uh, that's a bunch of enemies. Yes. That seemed like invincibility frames to me. Hmm. It's all right, we can go back to our body. <sighs> Superior moonshine. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. I'm not, I'm not sure how we regenerate, like, whether we can go back into our body. Assume, find a spawn point, whatever that may be. Mm-hmm. I'm sure once that first episode is posted, the the comment section is going to be explaining every single use of like, what's tar, what's resolve, what's germination. Yeah. It's kind of late to say this, but please don't tell me anything. I'm enjoying the fact that I have no fucking clue what I'm doing. That if makes you, me feel mysterious. <laughs> I don't want to go look at Fextra Life, okay? <laughs> Even though there is, um, there's actually an icon to the wiki in the main menu. So <laughs> I think maybe they intend you to use it, but I'm not going to, at least unless I really, really have to. Yeah, I think so this is where we die. Yes. Don't spoil or I will cyber bully you in the comments. Where did he went in there, right? Yes. I think. Isn't that where the... No. Am I misremembering? Is this near the um, extra hard mode place? I'm not sure. No, this is something different. Wait. No, I think that is it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Never oh, mind. I can't turn around, though. <laughs> <laughs> Commit to the crawl. You a worm, you're going all the way. A worm can't turn around in its tunnel. 
Can it? Can it? I doubt it. Probably not, huh? Because it pull only... a Yui. Whip a shitty. <laughs> so, blob. <laughs> Revenge. I don't know the safest way to take him out. Would Harden protect me from poison? Actually, yeah, that's a great question. Like, maybe I can have it attack me, and that's fine. Yeah. Yeah, nice. You can just Harden. That makes it a lot easier. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm terrified of this thing. Oh, that's a frog! <gasps> no, that's not a frog, that's a toad. I'm so scared of it, though. What if it's just like, Hello, I'm an old wise being and I do not wish to fight you. Wait, I think you're right. I can't target it. Gorf! <gasps> Gorf! Ah! Uh, Gorf! The music of the night. It's croaking. You appreciate it, unlike the shallow layabouts around here. Gorf is really cool looking. Yeah. Gorf's kind of a nasty boy, but we like him. I'm no, boring you're you. not! Gorf, you would never! Gorf, it's just because this body, this sleeve is dead, so it's got like this bored look. But we don't mean that! We're not bored with you, Gorf! Tis alright, I take no offense. We don't mean to offend! I'll think up a way to entertain you better next time. Oh. Gorf! You're too <laughs> nice, Gorf! They're trying to be so hospitable to guests. Oh. Well, I have an idea. They were talking about music, right? Yeah. Maybe they'd appreciate it if we play some music. All right, I'm going to try to wrap. Here we are in the God, night. please don't. <laughs> Dear God. <laughs> I was going to rhyme night with fight. It would have been really epic. <laughs> Can you hear it? Ah, oh, that's just of the night. what they are saying before. And listen to the music of the night. We could try playing the whole song to see if anything happens, but probably nothing will happen. Yeah, I doubt it. If you hear meowing, there are no cats in this forest. It's just a bunch of our hungry cats meowing. Oh, so this really does just poison you, huh? Rosed rad? Did it say? It no, the you? tar spore. I just ate it, oh. and now I'm dying. <laughs> oh. Well, I guess it is noxious, huh? Why can we consume it, though? Like... Surely there's a better use for it than that. That's not useful. Maybe you can cook? Or if there's cooking? Oh, maybe. I forgot that was there. Inscription: Those within the obsidian walls seek oblivion. Their warship turbulent and reactive. They predict the birth of their savior, but they say he has already been born. Obsidian walls. Is that obsidian? Maybe. I think so. Hmm. I think they're an enemy. Can you have a playoff? Oh.
Oh, this sounds awful. <laughs> Surely if they were an enemy, they would have been angered by that. Oh! oh. Ah. That was a trap. Real nasty evil mean. Music is not to be used like that. We can't talk with them, but they're not attacking me. Mm. I guess I'll leave them. Sure. Oh. Oh no. <gasps> Damn, one handing it. Really fucking talented. Still not attacking me. All right. <laughs> oh, the game doesn't really quite want you to do that. Mm -mm. Still, it looks horrible when they're holding it. An ornate token from an opulent land. Getting struck will harden will grant a buff, which maybe I'll just read in here. Which will reduce the next damage taken. Huh. Okay. Hmm. Sounds more useful than rusty coins. <laughs> yes. God, I never use those things. Kind of worried they're going to try to attack me when I don't keep my eye on them. Nah. They're just a musician. Oh shit. There's a lot of them. I think I'm just gonna run for it. Damn snipers in my... in my... ye old middle-aged games. This is what British people sound like. They're like, <laughs> when they're not speaking words. Gamer wife, huh? Yeah. Christ. Oh no, that's a lot of peeps, huh? Is that the is that the Nope, that's not the musician. <laughs> I think I'm gonna retreat. Musicians still unsure of their life. <laughs> Do we even know where, where, how to like get back to where we started? Like, <laughs> nope. Where did you come from? We're never gonna do the main quest. We're stuck in this swamp for good. <laughs> I mean, isn't this all the main quest? Just explore and like find something, find a purpose. I know there is the focus thing, but like, where even was that? It was like right on your um Oh, left. it was right at the beginning? Yeah, it was right on your left at the beginning. You could see the building, and then you were like, I'm gonna go the other way, I'm gonna turn right. And then Should we go back and go there? Because like if maybe, we go back the same way, we won't perhaps. encounter any enemies. Yeah. And maybe we'll like figure out how to like use tar, etc. etc. Yes. Before we like lose it again. Orf. That's such a cool name. Yeah. I wish my mom had gotten named me Gorf instead of 
censored. <laughs> Gorf was my it's favorite the next name. generation character. What? Gorf was my favorite Star Trek Next Generation character. I've never... I don't even know if that's an actual character name. <laughs> it's not. It's just there's a character named Worf. No! Why did that... Why? Um... Either came from this way or they're on the right. Well, you definitely came from where the water flows. Yes, 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 yes. There. Yeah, up there. Okay. Like this video if you two are married to a cool gamer wife who's just good at video games and satisfying to watch. Dislike this video if you are not married. Shit. Rotten food. Think that's gonna heal? Mm, I don't know. Do I have anything that's gonna heal? Scripture of Defiance. Next parry refunds resolve on success. What's a parry? What's a resolve? I mean, I sort of know what a parry is, but I don't know how to activate it. Could be done by hardening at the right time. Could be done by dodging at the right time. Probably hardening. Probably, like right before the attack hits. This is probably going to poison us, right? Mm, yeah, maybe we should um, save that till we've like found some sort of a save point. Save point, save space. Like, you know, some place where just like no homophobia. We can like then try eating rotten food. Yeah. So I'm just going to be like one hit away from death, aren't I? I should not use those... I shouldn't use those. Use then it, The tar things, because then it builds it up in our bank that we can lose if we die. Yes. I might as well save those for when we can actually spend it. Yes. Maybe you shouldn't explore things like that then. Maybe you should just go to the building that where yeah. a person was like waving like, that... hello, come here. I don't know if they were waving though. Like, I, I need healing. Do you think I'm more likely to get healing over here or up there? I think up there, it's going to be like a safe space. It's going to be like, hello, you are XY, or like your body is like XY, and like you're here to be like blah, 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 and I'm here to help you. Like Dark Souls always very early on, it gives us a nice safe space and a nice woman who's like, hello, my duty is to like look after you. Healing. It's gay if you're a woman, and it's misogynistic if you're a man. The hell am I hearing? A tiger. Some roaring. Nice woman! Hello! You were right. Pray, what wayward spirit beckons? I shall name you foundling, and you may call me Sester Janessa. You're uninitiated in the Raphaid's mysteries, I see. What a curiosity you are, wearing a man like a shell. You've awakened him. But you know nothing of him yet. Fetch me one of his mementos, and some tar too, and I'm sure we can stir up some recollections. Of course, first you must find his name.
Sip the divine tar, sure. You must discover the shell's name to awaken its power. 250 tar. The brigands pointed us toward the temple. Shunned by the devout, their allegiances lie to those who are fatah, or spirits. They entertain themselves with drunken antics or violent cruelties. They know better than to attack us. But they followed us at a distance, hoping for scraps. Haros the Vassal. Give it the proper finish, R. Haros. Haros. <laughs> God, my R is terrible. Catching a glimpse is a chance to restore some health. Okay, okay, so I have two glimpses right now. I could get that. Killing two enemies in quick succession resets your hardened cooldown. Hmm. I mean, I guess I should get something, right? Yeah. I guess I'll go with that. Sure. Madman, I would come to realize, was not burdened with delusions, but truth. Yet the wary ear corrupts honest words into lies. I took him for a spy and cut him down. How else could he know so much about me? He had condemned himself with each utterance. Effigy of Haros. That's the thing we picked up? It said you couldn't use it before, now it says the shell's already inhabited? Yeah. That changed, I think? Yes. Maybe that's how you can, like, summon the shell to yourself. Hmm. When you're, like, using some other dude. It's just getting kind of gay. This. <laughs> you're just, like, trying to get into other men. <laughs> trying to be other men. Trying to get inside other men, just being like looking for that bear, <laughs> that trap's being set for. Where's my big bear, gay man? Huh? Sense so instinct. So that's like our next goal, isn't it? Mm. Or maybe it could be bodies that you could find, oh, shells it, you could find. Oh, it is, isn't it? Yes. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I think that's a cave we heard the nasty noises coming from. Oh. And lying down like a French girl is waiting for us. A body. Mm. Oh, bats! <gasps> bats! Love them. Mm. So I wonder... I don't know. I wonder how shells work. Are we going to be swapping back and forth depending on, like, do they have different abilities or what? Probably like different uh, armors, different skill sets, different. Yeah. Can't all be horrors. No. I still want to know where we can go to like reset. Like get our health back. Maybe we can't. Maybe it is here. Mm. Like, I guess this is the only thing we can spend our money on, huh? Yeah. Well, maybe if we go upstairs, there's going to be something else. Just then we're going to be like inside the building? Question mark. That's a weapon, isn't it? Yes. Oh, 
only road, the only road that I have ever known. Don't know where it goes, cause it's only me and my sick axe. Fucking chop wood and dude's legs. Looks like an ice pick, kinda. Yeah. Workbench. <gasps> oh. Weapon enhancement. Requires mechanical spike, molten spike. All requires things we don't have. Mm. So there's multiple weapons that we can get. There's an upgrade upgrade system for the weapons. Oh. <gasps> Hello. Is that a bird? Looks like it. Oh, it has an overgrown beard. Beard. Beak. Hasn't been taken care of by its owner. No, it's chained down and stopped from being able to see. Hmm. Tattered vestment. Sacred cloth bound to a forgotten sword. Cannot be used. This weapon is already equipped. Hmm? Remove seal. Oh. I Should I do that? I don't know anything about it. I mean, surely it's going to be like, yay, thank you for saving me. We're going to fly away to um, zoo now. Heck yeah, let's do it. Bird friend. I mean, if Gorf is our friend, then surely Burb will be. That's true. See, wife is always right. It's been so long since anyone raised a hand toward me in kindness. You seem different. Untouched by false truths. Fake news. Fortunately, I have little to offer you. Alternative facts. See in your hands. A small gift. But I expect you will find it useful. Would you grant me another favor? Anything. Deep within the temples of the devout, you'll find the sacred glands of the revered. Bring the glands back to me, so I can extract the true nectar. Just enough to heal me. Perhaps you too can use it to free yourself from this wretched land, before you end up like me. Hell yes. I'll bring you some glands. See, this oh. is a good game. Letting you befriend animals. Yeah, it's nice. The old prisoner has gifted you the tarnished seal. Enables you to parry enemy strikes. Oh, we couldn't even parry ah. before. Interrupting their attacks. The seal will also warn you of incoming unparryable strikes. Oh, it's nice that the game is letting us know what you can and cannot parry. I'm like in Dark Souls, in which is like yes. so fucking random. Yeah, that's why I never bothered parrying, because it's like, you can parry this, you can't parry this. It's random. Mm-hmm. Usually doesn't work on bosses, where you need it most. Left button. Oh. Seal infusion healing. The old prisoner has infused the seal, giving you, giving your parry the ability to leave an enemy vulnerable to an empowered repost. Seal requires great resolve to harness such an infusion. Performing an empowered repost will heal you. So. So I guess we now know what resolve is. Yeah, I guess it gives you the ability to do like really powerful counterattacks and heal yourself. Mm. So it's the yellow bars above your health. Oh, that's cool. That's the parry. Oh. Infinite parry. <laughs> Can I do a, a safe parry? Harden and parry? Maybe. Kinda. I can do both at the same time. Maybe I can do a safe parry. That's the dream. Goal.
think that's everything here. Wasn't there something downstairs? Do like you go even more downstairs? Yeah. Okay. Good. Because I imagine yes. that's where the glands are. Slowly. You're not ready. <laughs> that was so dismissive. You're not ready. What are you, my school bully? Maybe we can practice now. Aren't we going to explore the downstairs first? Yeah, let's do that. But I think talking with them and sipping the divine tar or whatever is probably going to heal us. Ah. So I think now would be a good place to test out parrying and stuff. Oh god. Oh, I thought it was going to be a downstairs. It's just a boss? No. Oh, thank god not. Well, that didn't work oh. great. I tried to parry. <laughs> Rip. It doesn't matter, our body's right there. Yeah. If it respawns us at her place. Yeah, better, right? Well, in any case, it's not that far of a walk to there. From the starting area. Because it was just literally just like, turn left. Ah, oh, it yeah. does. Oh. Your way. Please, mm. take this map. Oh. It's not unlike my own. It reveals the way of all flesh. Beyond life and death. Where spirits pass across the threshold. But your spirit is bound here. Unwilling to go on. Perhaps it has an obligation left to fulfill. I see. That's our bone home, isn't it? Yeah. And unlimited. Unlimited use. At the cost of all of your glimpses. Oh. You don't know anything about the game, but you know glimpses are something. They seem important. They're used for upgrades. Wait, where's our stuff? Oh, we, we just got it back, didn't we? Oh, yeah. I thought it'd be like a whole body. It was just like a red dot. Hmm. Maybe because it did, the game didn't want to cramp the screen. Maybe, yeah. Maybe there wasn't room for it. Okay, so let's see if sipping heals us. It does. It does. The other way is a nasty way to go. I just want to experiment with parrying a bit. Yeah. Something easy. And you could try eating the rotten food now. Hmm. Yeah, I'll do that when I go back to them. This one is not a lover. They are a fighter. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay, your resolve comes back when you like fight dudes. Oh, that healed a lot. Yeah. I think it looked like 20, 25, 50%. So now we don't have resolve. Mm -hmm. Let's see how much resolve we get from from just killing one person. Like a third of a bar? Yeah. Yeah, a third of a bar, because through killing fake people filled up a bar. Does it accomplish anything to parry and not do any special attack? Like, it doesn't seem to really do anything if you do that. Is yeah. the only purpose of it to do the special attack? I think so. I 
Yeah, that's a good amount. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you can't even, you really can't parry without it. Like, it's not even lighting up. Oh, So you have yeah. to have resolve to do it. <laughs> Stupid man. Um, I don't think I have enough health to test out invincibility frames. No, I would go safe. Let's test the rotten food. Small amount of health at a large cost to resolve. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so don't eat it unless you're like really, really desperate. I don't know, the thing is resolve is health basically. Yeah. In a way, so it seems not worth it at all. Yes. Okay. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you enjoyed so far, and when we return, I don't know, go explore more of the swamp. Say hi to Gorf, meet the tiger or whatever's growling out there. Make more animal friends. <laughs>